Hello YouTube, it's Lily Oetker and I am back again. Happy New Year. It's 2021. 2020 is finally over. For a lot of us, that was probably the worst year ever, even though we are still dealing with um, basically all of the issues that we had in 2020. But um, let's hope that they improve by, you know, next year at this time. Anyway, uh, today I have a What I Got For Christmas haul. Um, anyway, I hope that everybody had a happy holiday season. Um, and yeah, I'm just gonna show you guys what I got for Christmas. Of course, disclaimer, just gonna throw this in there. Of course, I'm not trying to brag about anything that I got. I know I'm very lucky to receive presents on Christmas and that a lot of people are not as fortunate as I am. So I just wanna say, this is not me bragging in any way, shape, or form. Um, I just like to watch these videos. I just watch Freddie My Loves videos, and of course, your girl loves Freddie. She always inspires me, so I thought that I would go ahead and show you what I got for Christmas. So without further ado, let's just get into the video. Hey, before we get into the video, you deserve good things, so don't forget to subscribe. Excuse me. The first thing that I got are actually the earrings that I'm wearing right now which I'll give you a close-up of, but they are, they say L and I, and on this side it says L and Y, and they are threaders. So you, this is just one whole thing and you just thread it right through. And yes, my earrings do say my name. Yeah, I, I have earrings that say my name. Is it a little bit narcissistic? Um, yeah, a borderline. But I gotta just, you know, give it up for my mom. She named me a really great name. I really like my name, and I love telling people my name. I love people calling my name. I don't know, it just makes me feel really special. And somebody goes like, hey Lily, you know? Uh, and I really like it, so... I saw these, and I asked for them for Christmas, and my little sister gave them to me, so thank you, Chloe, because I love them. Uh, my mom gave me... <laughs> I don't have the containers that these came in because I've been wearing them so much so they've just been out with the rest of my jewelry. My mom gave me these beautiful hoop earrings that are attached. Um, so you can wear these like from your doubles to your main piercing but I like to wear from my double to my cartilage piercing right here if you can see that and they are just gold and they have rhinestones on them. I'm totally obsessed. I've been wearing these so often um, and I just, I love them so much. So yeah, my mom got me these. Thanks, mom. Um, on to other things. My mom gave me this lovely set of Beatles nail polish. Um, I found this brand on Amazon and I really, really like them. They have low smell, free of the nine like toxic ingredients and um, it says no harm to skin which I really really like because shellac nail polish I mean obviously this is still gonna have some probably harmful chemicals in it but it's free of like the majority of them because it's actually really high chemicals and not too good for your nails because nails kind of soak up like what is put on them uh, so I really like this she just got me this set so it's got um, light pink, dark pink, white, and then two shades of blues, and then it's got this lovely sparkly color that is actually on my nails right now, except not that middle finger. Um, it's just like a silver sparkle, and it is so gorgeous. I am totally obsessed with it. My boyfriend gave me a box of just a ton of random things that I love from Taiwan that I buy there all the time. So this is probably not going to be as exciting, but I'm still going to show you. The first thing he got was a bunch of these Pocky like candies, but they're called Pepero and they've got the lion characters on them, which is really cute. He knows that I love everything lion friends. And then he also got me, he got me this cute little Sumiko Garashi um, pencil case which is just adorable. My last pencil case ripped. Um, and then on the inside, he got me so many refills for the Muji pens. Do the right way. He got me black, he got me a ton of my favorite ones, pink, I've already used some of them. A purple one and a blue one just still in here. 
um, which is super, super great because I love the Muji pens so much and I ran out of all of the ink and so he brought me a ton of them. He also got me a Muji eraser. This is just like their simple um, black eraser, super cute. And then he got me, see this one's like so cute, I don't even wanna use it. It just has my favorite rice triangles on it and it also has the cute little Japanese puppies on it, which is just adorable. Like, he also got me the Muji pencil case, which is super simple and minimalistic, and I really love the design of this. Um, and then inside of it, he got me a bunch of pens. He got me these really good pens from Taiwan, which he gave me in black, red, and blue. And these are really, really good pens for um, studying Chinese because I go through a lot of ink studying Chinese every single day. And then he got me red ones so that I can put in any corrections um, or highlight things that I need to go over and stuff like that. Um, Muji mechanical pencil, which I haven't even used yet, but it's going to be really good for studying Chinese too. And then he got me the refill for the mechanical pencil. Got me this Muji blue highlighter. And I think he got me the pink one too. This is my old one, I just put it in here. So after that, he got me this really nice, um, he said it's a Japanese brand. I think it's from Senka, but I'm not sure. Um, he just bought this. It's chapstick because your girl goes through a lot of chapstick. It's really dry in winter. And then this is such a special gift. So kind of a backstory to this. When I was in Taiwan, almost two years ago, in 2019. Um, his mom bought us some really nice, like, Italian um, lip balm, and it was mango flavored, and I loved it so much. Like, I, I just love lip balms. I carry them with me everywhere I go. But this lip balm was special. It was, like, fancy. I loved the packaging. And his mom gave it to us, and I use that lip balm all the time, every day. I put it in my nightstand and I use it every single day. Before I went to bed, I would take it out and put it in my purse because I just loved the way it smelled and it had like a good memory attached to it and I loved it so much. So because I used it so much, one day I put it in my pajama pocket, I believe, or my pocket of my robe, and you guessed it, I put that into the washing machine and I washed it and gone away. It was ruined, all of the lip balm. So I told that story to my boyfriend and I was like, I'm so sad. And he was like, oh, okay, maybe my mom can like get you another one. So it turns out she couldn't find to buy another one, but she just gave me the one that she bought for herself. And I was so touched that like she just gave it to me and look at this, I love this lip balm. It's like such good quality. Look at this lip balm. It is so pretty. And it smells like mango, which is one of my absolutely favorite food, fruits ever. So thank you so much to my boyfriend's mom. That was really, really sweet of you. So let's see, what else did I get from my boyfriend? He got me a bunch of Hello Kitty baby wipes. Now you're probably wondering, Lily, why do you have Hello Kitty? Why, why did he get you Hello Kitty baby wipes? And let me just say, you just need to carry around baby wipes in your purse. And if you don't, girl, girl, you never know when you're gonna need one. You never know what you're gonna need one for. It's just like, it's just a good thing to carry around. What if you need to wipe something clean? What if you gotta take a number two? I mean, I'm not about to walk around with a dirty, you know. So, um, these are a must have. He also gave me, I don't even know if I can find all of them because I think that they're in the wash. But he gave me, he loves um, Uniqlo socks. They're really, really good quality. And I am like straight out of socks. So he got me a blue one. He got me some nice beige ones, which is this color is like really growing on me. I think he also got me another blue one. And then he gave me a pink one. And then he also gave me these socks, which is like, they're like a different brand. I'm wearing them right now, but they're like really thick and comfy and cozy and soft. Um, so I totally needed these and that was super nice to receive. And then he also gave me something else, but I'm gonna save it to show you later because I love it so much. Moving on to the other things that I got. 
My older sister gave me these super cute um, Sanrio characters Fuji Instax film for my um, Instax camera, which is really adorable. It's just got like Hello Kitty and the Sanrio characters on it. And then she gave me this super pretty it's a Polaroid photo album. So you put your Polaroids in. As you can see, I was super excited and I already did it. Um, and it's like the perfect size for them. And it just, look how cute the pattern is. It's little swans. It just reminded me of Swan Lake and it's like the perfect color. I love it. I love it so much. I love photo albums. I'm really getting into them. Anyway, she also gave me this giant clip on hair bow. It's got one of these little clips on the back and it's like this velvety material and it's it's super cute. I really I really like the way that it looks with my short hair. Um, so those are the things that my older sister got me. Thank you, Zulia. And then my younger sister, oh my gosh, I had to show this. My younger sister gave me this earrings, these earrings, but she made a jewelry box for them that like opened up and then she had them in here on a little jewelry holder. How cute is that? She like literally made this, like crafted it, and it's got a cute little heart tab. So freaking creative, what the heck. My mom gave me this beautiful, lovely new journal. Can you see, it says journal right here. And the side, it has gold pages. What do you call that? It's so gorgeous, like this journal is just, I've already started writing in it, as you can see, if you can see, if it's not too bright. Um, an interesting thing, I was actually looking at a journal like this. Normally, because I just finished my journal, as you saw if you watched my Vlogmas, um, normally I go for like the largest journal that I can get because I write a lot, but I was actually thinking about getting like a smaller journal, like a cozier, smaller one, um, just like this, and she must have been reading my brainwaves because she got me exactly that. So thank you, Mama. I am absolutely loving this journal so far. Super, super soft, comfy pants. They say love in gold right there. And they, oh my God, you guys, it just feels so soft. Like these really keep you super warm. And the fabric on the inside is the fabric on the outside, which is totally perfect. They're like perfect for winter in Wisconsin. Exactly what I needed because guys, I do not handle cold weather well. And then along with that, it's inside out because I just washed it because I've been wearing it. She gave me this super cute sweatshirt and it's got little kittens on it. How cute is that? It totally looks like, you know, a sweater that your grandma would wear, but that's like why I like it. Like it's got the little flowers around it and these cute little kittens. I, I like, I can't get over it and it's nice and oversized and warm. I just, I really like this. And I feel like I've been seeing like this style of like print on sweatshirts coming back a little bit. Um, it's kind of like trendy now or whatever, you know, not that I follow the trends, but like my sister also gave me this cute little um, strawberry socks. I mean, how cute is that? If you know me, you know that strawberries are my favorite food ever. Well, favorite fruit, I should say. And you also know that I love cute little socks like this. Like if you are wearing socks and they're not cute colors, um, anyway, so then I also got these lovely pajamas. They're matching pajamas. Um, I don't know if I can show you. I wore these last night for the first time. And girl, let me tell you, these are so soft. I think that these are like the Target brand. Yeah, stars above. They are just these pink pajamas. And then they have... Um, white trim on them. I don't even know if you can really tell. Um, but they're just long sleeves, so here's the top, and then the bottoms have this, like, nice little silky tie. And, like, the quality on these just feels so good. And the way that they just, like, hug your body, and, like, the fabric is so soft, they're, like, the most comfortable pajamas. And I love that. Like, I kind of am running out of pajamas a little bit because all of my pajamas are just getting old. And I really don't like it when pajamas are not like the most comfortable thing you've ever worn, you know? Like they should just feel like hug in clothing form. And that's what these feel like. And look, look at this color. Like it's just such a nice, like calming 
pale baby pink and then with the white trim i just i'm totally obsessed i'm gonna probably be living in these for the rest of quarantine oh and then also one of our family friends they gave they dropped off a box and inside of it for um, me and my sisters and my mom were handmade little plushies and it's super super cute it's got a cute tag on it too i left it on there because the bow is like tied perfectly but it's funny because i um this these friends of ours i would always talk about um this dream that i had about narwhals swimming up in the sky and um they remembered and sewed me a hand sewn narwhal which was just the most touching heartfelt thing ever it's just so it's so sweet of them two exciting things last up this first thing that i have is a leotard and it is one of the cutest leotards i have ever seen if you're wondering where i got this it is super super exciting because i actually just opened an online boutique where you can purchase this and a bunch of other super unique and beautiful leotards and other dance wares soon to come. Um, it is called Florida Lily Dancer and I will link it in the description box below. But I'm super excited to announce this and I've been working on it for a while now behind the scenes. And when I saw this leotard, I was just like, I, I, must, I must own this now. Like as soon as I see this and also the world must own this because it is so cute and I just really believe that like when you're dancing and when you're in rehearsals and everything like that you just gotta like express your personal taste and your personal style but you also have to feel super comfortable in it which is a great thing that this is fully lined all the way down and it actually has like double lining like over the boob area so it's got like the pink lining and then this lining and then one more of this so it's very supportive which I really really appreciate because one thing that has been bothering me for dancer that I kind of recently realized um, is that a lot of leotards are not that supportive in the breast area and like if you think about it dance is so athletic we should be wearing like sports bra level you know support so the fact that these leotards have super super supportive uh, fully lined fronts is really important to me um, and the fabric is just super super soft it's got a very nice white trim on the neckline and down the back and then it's got white trim as well on the three quarter sleeves and I mean look at this Peter Pan color and the buttons like girl I I am in love it's just and the fabric is so soft and good quality like I can't believe this so yeah if you're interested if you are a dancer if you know a dancer check out my site below I will have a link in the description like I said and I would really really appreciate it I just opened it up and I'm super super excited to uh, share all these beautiful leotards with the world so anyway moving on to the last thing that I got which I'm so I've never received something like this before you've probably seen this sitting here in the background it's not even in this anymore, but I just thought I would show you. My boyfriend got me an item from Coach, and it came still, like, he saved the bag for me and everything. And isn't it just so gorgeous? Like, like I said earlier, I always watch Freddie My Love, and she always has all of those designer bags. And I've always been like, oh my gosh, I long for the day to open an item out of a Coach bag. And this Christmas it happened, which I was just over the moon with. And then inside this bag, they have a cute little second bag with a cute little bow on it. How, how fancy is that? Like, I was not ready for this. Anyway, so inside this, they have a little coach, like, card holder where they normally put, like, their receipt, I think. But on the very inside... My boyfriend put stickers from Watson's because he knows it's my favorite store in Taiwan and they have a point system and these stickers have Hello Kitty on them which he knows is my favorite and I was so touched because my boyfriend just knows me so well. Um, anyway, getting on to the actual coach item. I know, I'm just talking about the packaging. He got me, me the beautiful Coach New York floral eau de parfum. <sighs> Look how gorgeous this is. Just take just take a gander. We're not even talking about the smell yet. Just just look at this. This 
says, look how gorgeous this container is. And look, it's got the little like cherry blossom and then the little coach tag on it in the, in the carriage. And then you turn this to spritz and it clicks and then you can spritz, which I think I shall. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. This smell is like a little bit, um, it's really sweet. Well, not really sweet, it's really floral and it's really sweet, but it's not overpoweringly sweet. It's like more, it just, it smells so fresh and so floral and it honestly, this perfume, I just think it fits me so well. Like. He could not have picked a better perfume and he told me that he went to the coach store and was there for hours because he didn't know if this would, if I'd like it or if it would fit me or which one to get. He couldn't decide between this one and the other one, but um, he chose this one and he did an amazing job because this is my favorite perfume now. It smells so amazing. Like I was kind of getting sick and tired of my old perfumes and then he gave me this one and I was like. I was so happy. So thank you so much. I love you, Mama. You, Ja. Um, yeah, and I think that's everything that I got for Christmas. I hope I didn't forget anything. I don't think I did. But, um, yeah, that's everything. I had a really, really nice Christmas and holiday season. And um, I hope you did too. Uh, I will see you next week with my next video. Until then, have a lovely time. Enjoy yourself. And... Stay safe and healthy. Bye-bye.